Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak your iPod Touch 3G, iPod Touch 4G, iPhone 3GS, iPhone 4, Apple TV and iPad. Now for this to work, all your devices will, be, will need to be running on Apple's 4.1 software and in this jailbreak we're going to be using a, pro a program called Green Poison as we can see up there. Now to this website I'm on where you will need to download um, the jailbreak, there will be a link in the description but basically it's just www trying to get it to focus, www.greenpoison.com and the last O is a zero. So there will be a link in the description. Now basically this jailbreak supports uh, Mac, Linux and Windows. Now in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to do it on both Mac and Windows. Uh, but for this example we're going to be using a Mac as you can see there. Now basically Mac and Windows is exactly the same thing. The way you do it will be exactly the same but if there are any differences I'll point them out through the video. So basically go to the link in the description, download the jailbreak for whatever um, operating system you're on. Um, I've already downloaded it for Mac, so you just download whichever one you're on. Um, if you are on Windows, you will need, once you've downloaded it, you will need to extract the files and then um, run it. So basically I'm just going to go to my downloads in Mac, click on Green Poison as we can see there. So basically here's the program, and for this um, tutorial I'm going to be using the iPod Touch fourth generation with the front facing camera and the back facing camera up there. Alright, so firstly you want to make sure your device is plugged into I, uh, sorry, into your computer. Um, iTunes does not need to be opened. So the first thing you want to do is turn off your device and you do that by just holding the sleep button. So it's going to slide to power off and let that power off there. Now firstly, for this jailbreak, you will need to put your device in DFU mode. So basically, it's just got some on-screen instructions. Basically, get ready to start. Press and hold the sleep button. Continue holding sleep. Press and hold home button. Release the sleep button and continue holding home. And basically, with that icon there, it will have a countdown for how long you hold each button. And basically, at the start, you just press jailbreak. So like I said, this will be exactly the same for both uh, Windows... Uh, sorry, um... Windows and Mac, and just to prove it, I got my laptop next to me. This is what the uh, basically program looks on the um, PC. So basically, it's basically identical, and basically you just click prepare to jailbreak, and um, it'll do the exact same thing. It'll come up with the counter and etc. So now I'm going to put our uh, device into DFU mode. I'm just going to put the camera down because it will require two hands to do this. I'll try and make it so that you can see as best as possible. Alright, in this hand I'm going to be holding the uh, power sleep button, in this hand I'm going to be holding the home button. So basically, actually I'll do it with the other hand. So basically I'm going to click um, jailbreak and it'll give me a countdown um, ready to start. So I'll try and do it as best as you can see guys, but I will um, go through it as I talk while I'm doing it. So jailbreak, get ready to start, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, press and hold the sleep button. One, two, three. Press and hold the home button for 10 seconds. Now, when you do this, guys, it'll have a countdown. So, three, two, one. Release the sleep button. Continue holding the home button for another 10 seconds. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Now it says um, jailbreaking, so you can let go of the home button now. So, as you can see, there, white screen. So, as you can see, there, it says now jailbreaking. And it's doing its thing. Just hold it up like that. As you can see, that's doing something there. It's ex probably downloading, extracting all the files. And now, just a pointer: when this comes up saying complete, do not close it just yet. Just wait for all this to do its stuff before you close it. There will be notes and tips in the description of um, like of problems people are getting, or if I come up with something later I didn't say in the video. So just make sure in the description you read, uh, some, there'll be some tips and notes and pointers down there. So basically it's done its thing here, it's just rebooting now, and we'll wait to see if it works. Alright, so now it's done, I'm just going to slide to unlock. Basically, as we can see there, we have the loader icon has come up, Try and get it to focus. Basically it's just a white icon, icon that says loader, so you want to go ahead and open that. Loading sources. As you can see here, you have the... Um, option to install Cydia. So we're just going to click on Cydia and go ahead and click on install Cydia. So downloading, it shouldn't take too long guys. Alright, so now it's extracting. 
Now it asks you, do you want to remove the loader from your device? So I'm going to click remove, I suggest you do. Basically that means that the loader icon, that the blank white icon that we saw before, to remove that, you don't need it once you've installed Cydia anyway. I'm just going to remove it because I don't want that white icon on my screen. Let's hit remove. Basically go back to the home screen. Alright guys, so let's just finish rebooting and we'll go slide to unlock. Slide to the next screen and there we have it. As you can see we have Cydia. Thanks guys for watching. I hope this has been a good, uh, basically helpful tutorial on how to jailbreak with Green Poison. Remember this will work with the iPod Touch 3G, iPod Touch 4G, iPhone 4, iPhone 3GS, Apple TV, uh, iPad, and remember your devices must be on the IL uh, 4.1 software. Now this has been with Green Poison. Remember there will be links, tips, and um, notes in the description, so check that out. And yeah, basically this is on Windows and Mac. And yeah, so thanks for watching. Peace.